How we doing today, fellas? We back again. Your boy Keith is here with Million Men, trying to teach you how to become a man of value, a man of worth, and a man of means. So it's another video. It's that time. Today we're gonna be talking about how to get fit in 2021. We're gonna be talking about how to get that body right, how to get that mind right. How to... We're gonna talk about all that. Listen, listen. Let's get into it. First thing you gotta do is I need you to get your vitamins. I know, I know your mama told you you needed your vitamins and your vegetables to be big and strong. But listen, these vitamins is crucial to your, your overall well-being. Like, listen to me. I got a couple for you. I got the examples today. So we got this maca root. Maca root is great for blood flow. It's great for just your men's health overall. I ain't no doctor. I ain't prescribing you nothing. I'm just telling you what I did to start feeling better. So don't don't kill me. Look up the do the research. I got another one for you. Turmeric. Turmeric is another one. It's another one. It's crucial to overall inflammation, bringing down some of that inflammation. A lot of y'all got all this inflammation in your body. You got this joint pain. You got all that stuff flowing through you. Listen, this help with your blood pressure. All that. If you anything like me, I got high blood pressure. I know. I'm young. I look good, I look, mm, but I got high blood pressure, bro. I love one for you. Let show you. If you working out, all that protein you eating, if you don't got enough of this in your system, enough of healthy fats in your system, you ain't, you ain't digesting none of that anyway. Last one, your multivitamin, your multivitamin. You need your multivitamin because I know if you like me, you're not eating every single vegetable, every single fruit. You ain't getting every single nutrient that your body needs to feel right every day. So I need you to get your maca root. I need you to get your fish oil. I need you to get your men's multivitamin and your turmeric. And then the maca root also help with the blood flow. And if you and me know anything, we know blood flow is real important to a man's body. I ain't going to say I'm about for it, but it's good in that department too. All right. Next thing. Next one. I need you to start stretching. I know some of y'all are like stretching. What you need me to stretch? Listen, stretching is good for that blood flow. Like, listen, it's good for relieving that tension, relieving that stress. I know it's other ways to, to do it, but this is one of the safest, easiest ways. You ain't got no excuse. You ain't got no reason that this is, you can do this in your room. You can do this anywhere. Just literally, nice. I ain't going to stretch for y'all, but you know what you got to do. Listen, if you don't know what stretches to do, I'll talk about that in a separate video. I'll do a whole stretch routine if y'all want. If y'all interested in that kind of stuff, you let me know. But I can break down anything you want me to break down. But I need you to start stretching. It's great for your blood flow. It's great for your relieving tension. And then if you playing sports, I know a lot of y'all try to get on the court. That you ain't you ain't stretched in about who knows how long. You ain't you ain't been moving around. You ain't been doing nothing. Been playing on the sticks. You've been in the house all COVID, and now you're trying to get back on the court. You need to stretch. I need you to start stretching again. This is gonna help you get your body right. And it's just good. It's good for your mental too. It's definitely good for your mental. Your mental space needs that time where you calm down, you taking in some of that fresh air, you blowing out all that air that's been just sitting in your lungs. Try this for me, try this. This is just one more step to getting fit in 2021. Next one. Next one I got for y'all is exercise daily. Now, some of y'all ain't got the money for a gym membership. You don't need a gym membership. You don't need a gym membership to do no push-ups, to do no sit-ups, no pull-ups, to go outside for a walk every day. I know it's cold where some of y'all at. You can see my breath. It's cold out here. I'm out here for y'all. Listen, just do a little bit of exercise on a daily basis. That's just, man, that could be going for a nice little walk, going for a nice little jog. Put your sweatsuit on. I know you got one for Christmas. Put your sweatsuit on. Put your coat on. Go for a nice little jog. Get some fresh air, get some fresh blood moving. Listen, it could be the gym. It could be a little bit of hooping, a little bit of football, a little bit of hockey, whatever you into. And then this is going to be great for your body, man. You talking about your body. You only got one of those. Like, come on. You only got one of them. Don't waste it. It's a, it's a valuable resource. And then the crazy thing is, me and you both know how much money it costs to just to get your body back right once you mess it up. Come on. Hear me out. Do what I'm telling you to do. You're going to see positive change in your physique as a whole. Try it. Then let me know if it don't work. Next one. I know this is one of them ones. This is going to be one of them ones where you're going to be like, now you just, you end up with one of them. Journaling. 
Now, the journaling can take place on your phone. You can get a pencil and paper if that works better for you. I know some of y'all rappers, and that's the only time you express anything. But listen, journaling is going to be essential to your growth. Journaling is a great way to, like, I don't know, it's crazy for me, putting some of them things down, facing some of them demons I had, facing some of them monkeys I had on my back. I couldn't really deal with them until I put them on paper and I was able to see what the problem was. Like, it's funny. When I put it on paper and I had to read it back to myself, I was like, I let myself go. I let myself go through that. Like I did that. Oh, I, yo, I experienced that. And I ain't even ever even think of it like that. But just journaling. If you want some help on what to journalize, your boy got you. I'll tell you exactly what you need to do. Write down them goals. Here's the more positive aspect of it. Write down your goals, man. So you can see the tangible, like, to put that thing on paper or put it in your phone and every day just take an account. Like, if you have a goal of losing 100 pounds for the whole next year, you know, all right, 12 months in a year, that's going to be around eight pounds a month, right? So if your goal is to lose eight pounds and you reading that goal every single day, you're not only reminding yourself, you're holding yourself accountable. I need you to hold yourself accountable. This is the last thing I'm going to tell you. Accountability is an essential part of getting fit. Like it is. Like you can't not hold yourself accountable. Like, cause who else is gonna hold you accountable but you? Your girl can look at you, but your girl will start to doubt you if you start doubting yourself. A lot of times, like, or your boy, I, it don't matter. I, 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 I don't discriminate. A lot of times, what we don't realize is if you're not holding yourself accountable, your girl is not gonna hold you accountable. She gonna hear the words that you said, and then she gonna be like. You always say stuff like that, but, and then you're going to take that shot to the ego and be like, what you trying to, listen, the reason, the reason your ego is hurt is because you letting you down. Like, you're not holding yourself accountable. So don't expect her to be cooking your meals and cooking her food when you say you're going to eat right. I need you to learn how to cook. Listen, your boy know how to cook. I, you know, I'm low-key a chef. I could throw a little picture in here and me in the newspaper cooking it up. Your boy is a chef a little bit. If y'all want to learn how to cook, I'll help you with that too. I'm, I'm a holistic man and I want to make more holistic men. That's what Million Men's about. It's another video down. This is how you get fit in 2021. Take your vitamins. I need you to stretch every day. I need you to exercise, get some movement. At least get some movement on a daily basis. Some of y'all can't get, you know what I mean? Some of y'all a little overweight. You know, that's cool. You're my brother. I'm going to tell you what to do. Lean up against that wall. Hit them push-ups. Get down on the ground. Hit them crunches. Literally, go for a walk. Now, if you got a bike or something in the basement, get on that thing. You got, you mean you got a little treadmill? Turn it on. Come on. You already know this. You heard this before. I'm, I'm just here to remind you what you already know. And the last one is journaling. I want you to actually take a different approach to how you lived last year to this one. This one coming up, this one's important. This one's real. You only here because you know it's real. Like, come on. I need you to actually take a moment. Get your book, get your pad, get your phone, whatever you're... I need you to get whatever you need that you're going to hold yourself accountable to because I'm holding you accountable. Your girl's holding you accountable. Your son, your daughter, all of them, they holding you accountable. They know the way. They hold you accountable for the results. They don't hold you accountable through the process. They hold you accountable to the results. If you say you're going to lose 100 pounds, they looking at, yo, how much, yo, I know last year you said you was going to lose 100 pounds. What happened? It's 2022. You ain't losing 100 pounds. Or for some of y'all, the goal is even smaller than that. They hold you accountable for results. So I need you to be focused on the process. It's another video. A million men. This is your boy, Keith. We'll see you on the next one.